Hello and welcome to Minerik U, training in 60 seconds. I've dedicated this final segment on linear and rotary motion to units of measure. When sizing, judging performance, or simply just picking which technology to use, I often hear people make errors with units, such as referring to torque and RPM in linear movement. Rotary motors are often rated in horsepower and specified using RPM and torque. However, linear movement uses thrust, like pounds force, and movement in feet per second or some equivalent distance per unit time. For example, assume a rotary motor driving a linear conveyor. For rotary motion, torque is equal to force times distance. So the force exerted on the load will be available torque divided by the radius of the pulley. This is analogous to thrust produced by a linear motor technology. Also, circumference is equal to pi times diameter. So if a rotary shaft is used to drive a pulley, the speed of the belt will be 3.14 times the diameter of the pulley, and the units will be feet per minute, centimeters per second, or similar. That does it for this training minute. Thanks for watching.